What is good everybody? Welcome back to another My Damn Toys video. Do you smell what The Rock is cooking? So in today's video guys, we are taking a look at the Best of Attitude Era Rock Elite figure as well as the rest of my Rock collection right here. We're not going to do a regular review like we uh, usually do. We're just going to take a look at all these rocks right here. I'm just going to crack the hoe open. And uh, we did pick up this figure from Ringside Collectibles using the promo code MDTOYS to save 10%. The Rock says if you don't use the promo code MDTOYS to save 10%, you can take your figure, turn that bitch sideways, shove it up your candy ass, and have a nice day. So that's that's what I'm dealing with right here, guys. We did get this figure from the good old sponsor, Ringside Collectibles. And, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and knock him out of his packaging. And here we have the rock out of his packaging, guys. I am liking this rock figure a lot, especially if you compare him to his other figures. We got him in his nice black slacks, and he does come with the gold sunglasses, which we have seen before. I believe we got it with the uh, Defining Moments rock figure right here in the purple and black and gold trunks. And this is the first time we've ever got a cloth shirt like this from the rock. He always used to wear these uh, nice t-shirts, or not t-shirts, but he used to wear these long button-down shirts to the ring. And it would be really cool if we could get some more of them. I know this is one of... Uh, his coolest one's the white and gold with the lines and stuff on it. Looks very nice. He's got his gold chain on there and everything. This is a very nice Rock Elite. I do like it. It gave us the good articulation pants. And, uh, yeah, it's just a great Rock figure. Not too much craziness going on. We've seen this Rock head scan with the Elite 47, which is right here. We have uh, we got a special shirt, obviously. We've seen these pants before. We've seen this torso before. I do love this torso for the Rock. I think it's the best Rock torso. Uh, these torsos over here, this Rock... And the uh, ringside exclusive rock right here. Those are way too big. I would love to get some more rocks to do some torso switches because he was not that jack quite yet. He didn't get jack like that until he moved off into Hollywood. You know, when he returned in 2013, that was definitely what he looked like. He was jack back then, but uh, or that in that year. But he was not jack. You know, way back when when he first started. So I think it's kind of dumb how they're inconsistent with the torsos. You know, they gave us the great torso and then they go back to a jack torso. Then they go back to the right torso. So I don't know. I'm very glad that they gave us the right one right here. Obviously, this rock figure is very, very dope. You spin him around here, you got the lion on the shirt right there. I think it's very cool that they gave us a cloth shirt, and um, I'm looking forward to seeing in the future if we get any more cloth shirts like this. Maybe this is uh, a sign of future stuff to come that we'll get more cloth t-shirts. Out of all these Rock Elites, I would say that uh, this one ranks pretty high. I think it's a very nice figure, especially from that era. We don't have too many from that era of the Rock, so I think that's pretty cool right there. And uh, I wish we would get like an early 2000s Rock. This is about late 90s. I would like one in the red. And what, when he was the World Heavyweight Champion, you know, he, he was toting around the big gold championship in the early 2000s with the red uh, Rock logos on his tights. That's the kind of, I think we got a basic of it before, I think, in the SummerSlam Heritage Line. I'm not exactly sure, but uh, I would like to see that in Elite form. I'll probably get a custom made anyways, just because I'm a stupid head idiot moron, stupid head idiot, stupid moron, idiot dumb. Yes! Why? Why? But yeah, guys, I, I really don't have anything else to say about this figure. You get the cool sunglasses, you get the nice gold chain, you get the nice shirt, you get a WWF E should say WFE because it's the scratch logo. It was WWF at that time, but uh, we've seen the microphone before. We've seen these legs before. Really cool articulation on this guy. He can do the full splits. He can literally do all kinds of stuff with these articulated legs. And uh, yeah, I think it's cool that we got a rock in slacks. Maybe I'll buy a few of these and uh, take the t-shirt off and do some different looks of the rock in the... Uh, the black slacks right there. I also want to do a few rocks in training shoes from the early 2000s as well with a couple different shirts. There's some cool shirts on eBay that you can pick up for your rock figures. Really looking forward to building up the rock uh, timeline with my elites. I mean, we got what? 10 right here. We have 10 elites right here, but I think in my total collection, I have 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. I have 19 rock elites now if you add this one in there, so that's pretty cool. And I cannot wait to add more. Love the rock. One of my favorite wrestlers of all time, hands down. Probably the best on the microphone in the history of the WWE and F. So, I mean, my God, guys. Um, now he's like the highest paid male actor in Hollywood. So, I mean, he, he's definitely doing well for himself. And I actually thought about doing a uh, uh, movie wing, like where I take WWE superstars and make them into customs from their movies, like The Miz, John Cena, 
and The Rock, obviously, maybe a few other guys, and I think that'd be pretty cool to see, you know, see them all in their different movies. I want to see The Rock in his uh, Baywatch or uh, a few of his action movies, and I think that would be pretty sick. But that pretty much does it for this video, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy. I know it's nothing too special, but we did take a look at this Best of Attitude Era Rock Elite, and uh, if you smell what The Rock is cooking, leave me a dope comment down in the comment section down below. What did you guys think of that WWE figure clothing video from yesterday? I would be interested Interested to know what your guys' thoughts were. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at MyDamnToys. My phone is still freaking broken, guys. My God, I haven't been able to get on Instagram, interact with you guys, and talk in DMs, and you know what I'm saying? So I definitely need to... I, hopefully, my phone comes in today. If it doesn't come in today, I'm going to throw rocks across my driveway or something in anger. I don't know. My mailbox also tipped over if you'd like to see that. I bet you guys will get a kick out of some vlogs or something if I posted vlogs of me just doing random BS. But, yeah, guys... Subscribe to the channel for more epic WWE figure videos, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you.